one of the Cleveland Browns' star players, Nick Chubb. This injury occurred in a game against their rival team, the Baltimore Ravens, at their home stadium, First Energy Stadium. In the video that went viral on social media, you can see how Nick Chubb suffered an injury in the first quarter of the match. While attempting to get past the Ravens' defense, Chubb suddenly tripped and fell to the ground. Video footage shows that one of the Ravens' players appears to pull his leg, which then causes Chubb to fall hard. The medical team immediately gave Chubb first aid and took him to the treatment room. At this time, further details regarding the injury have not been announced, but many football fans and analysts are concerned that this could be a serious injury that could affect Chubb's career in the long term. Cleveland Browns running back Nick Chubb went down with an injury, and Joe Buck and Troy Aikman let everyone know how bad it was. Chubb was tackled on a run near the goal line, and he immediately grabbed his left leg. It didn't look good, but then the broadcasters indicated that it was a lot worse than it even appeared on first glance. I'm told the replay of Nick Chubb getting injured is not to be seen, play-by-play -play announcer Joe Buck said on the ABC broadcast. As Buck said that, the replay was shown in the stadium, and the crowd reacted with a loud groan. Yeah, we're not going to show it. It's as bad, as you can imagine, analyst Troy Aikman said. Chubb was hit low by Steelers safety Minka Fitzpatrick as he was being dragged down by another defender. That caused his knee to bend in a way it shouldn't. Chubb was carted off the field after going down. Steelers fans, who saw the replay, chanted his name and gave him an ovation as he left for the locker room, Buck said on the broadcast. Chubb was immediately ruled out due to what the team said was a knee injury. Jerome Ford, Chubb's backup, scored on the next play, but the celebration was understandably muted. Chubb suffered a major knee injury in college when he was tackled near the sideline and landed awkwardly. That came during the 2015 season and was to the same left knee he injured Monday night. Chubb returned for the 2016 and 2017 seasons at Georgia and was a second-round pick of the Browns. Chubb is one of the best running backs in the NFL and a key cog in the Browns' offense. If the injury is as bad as it looked, it's a massive blow for the Browns early in the season. Nick Chubb, known as one of the best running backs in the league, has been a key element in the Cleveland Browns' ground game. His powerful presence and ability to generate significant yardage have made him a top choice in the team's offensive strategy. At the time this injury occurred, the Browns were struggling to win a game against the closely fought Ravens. This injury is of course a huge blow for the team, which will now have to find a way to replace Chubb's presence in the remaining games. Nick Chubb's fans and colleagues expressed their support via social media. They hope that this injury is not too serious and that Chubb can recover quickly. Cleveland Browns management has also not provided an official statement regarding this injury. They will continue to monitor Chubb's condition and provide updates to fans as more information becomes available. Nick Chubb's injury on September 19, 2023, will be a topic of conversation in the coming days, and fans will be anxiously awaiting news about their star player's recovery and future.